All right, we're back in this game. It's been a while since my last recording. Anyway, I mean, I'm gonna upload these probably all at the same time. Yes, I can hear you. Everything went pitch black for a second. Only a second. I guess you can't feel time in this universe. Because it's been like half a year since I played this game now, and I don't remember where I was or what I was doing. Uh, yes, okay, so there were robots. There, were, there was a robot on a boat that I had to give something, and I have a bottle of, like, water. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. I wish I could refresh myself on... I, I think I'm going to refresh myself on what I actually did last time. Um, I have to apologize for the awful quality of the episodes for this, because, um... I had my recording quality really low, and I wasn't recording at my full resolution of my screen. Um, I was recording like half the resolution, so it would have, would have been really bad, and I also didn't turn off cursor recording, and I had the cursor on top of the game. So I have to apologize that that was such a bad quality. Uh, if I remember correctly, I went here, but there was nothing that I could do. I don't think I explored over here yet, though. If I can even go over here. I can? Okay. So yeah, after this I'll kind of refresh myself on what my goal even was, but... I remember I have to make it to the, the tower in the center of the islands. Yeah, I just, uh, I don't know. It's been so long since I played this game and I kind of wanted to come back to it. Because I did want to finish it. I remember being taught in school about how the water's surrounding forests stretched until the boundaries of space. But at some point, the prehistoric oceans receded, forming what is now the Barrens. I wonder where all that water went. These tiny shrimp are swimming in this jar. Yeah, there have been multiple of those, hey? I'm scared of ladders. So I think I already did some of this, but I'm just warming up to this again. I don't actually remember, like, what is what is the key that I assigned to open my inventory? <laughs> I don't remember. Um, can I go into my settings and just check? Press F1. Uh left. This is really great gameplay footage. Uh, Q key, backspace key. Okay, backspace key is cancel. And I made enter or Q, I guess, the action. Backspace, escape. Uh, that makes no sense. E. Down, right, shift to run. Okay, yeah, I can run. Uh, E key to deactivate, and F for items. Okay. Cancel that. Uh, just go back to the game. Can I go back, please? Escape. Enter. Oh, backspace. Okay, it's cancel, yeah. So, F. Right. This is my items. It's the sun. The full of noxious fumes. The needle is particularly long. And I have my cursor on the game again, don't I? I'm gonna... Whoops. Off you go. At least I didn't have it up until that point, so it won't be for the entire video. Needle is particularly long. Uh, crowbar. Makeshift crowbar made from a pipe. Found in the barrens. It's written in an unknown language. I remember that. Yet, yeah. a gas mask used to filter air for breathing. Okay. Oh, we're going to the next area. Okay. Wearing my gas mask. Right, this loops around, doesn't it? Something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. Is that a result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? I doubt it's a coincidence in a game like this. Hey, if the game can be self-aware, then I can mention the game in a sort of fourth wall-breaking way. I already got the uh, bottle full of noxious fumes from one of these things, so I don't need to get another. 
Uh, wasn't I going to go back and try and fix that robot? I think that's what I was going to do. Let's see. Oh, is that the puzzle? The, the gas makes robots look practically new, so I can repair the robot by using the noxious fumes that I stored in the bottle. Is that the idea? Maybe that's the puzzle. I'm going to try that. Now I feel like... Uh, now I feel dumb for not catching on earlier to that, even though I hadn't seen that note before, I don't think. Like, yeah, duh, obviously you collected- Whoa, what are you? Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm? A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. To this world, I mean. See? I have the sun. Oh, the messiah. I do not know what to say. Greeting you was not part of my programming. Have you spoken to the prophet bot? Um, I think so, yeah. Prophet bot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, he cannot speak with anyone else, at least not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. What are you built for then? My purpose is to guard this settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Uh, why though? I have not been tamed. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. Hm. Robots have to be tamed? That's interesting. Okay, so I definitely haven't been here before because I don't remember that. It's just gonna be a lot of this uh, episode is me remembering where I was because I kind of quit this game for a long time, and I really like this game. I don't know, it's just a bit of uh, more of a pain to edit than other games because it's, uh, it's fourth wall breaking and, you know, I actually record my entire desktop and just crop it to the video when I'm doing this playthrough. And even the slightest, tiniest bit of editing is just, I'm, I'm a lazy guy, I guess. Whoops. <laughs> this way. This way. The robot is over here, I remember. It's down to the south here. It's an alternate pathway. It's a dead end. Whoops. Uh, this is a bit of a maze, isn't it? Go around. Oh, I can... I can run. Let's do that. Let's run. I've been walking this entire time. I've been walking even in the other episodes, but you know... I can just run here. This is the, th the thing is, I like walking in puzzle games, because it just is uh, easier to be observant when you're walking. And, you know, you get to take in the art. So this is the guy here. Um, let's talk to him again. Hang in there. Uh, how do I use it? Uh, Q? No. What was the key for this again? I don't remember. How do I use an item? Action. Can I not use this? Up, down, left, right. Q, shift. Like... I'm not... I guess I can't use it? Uh... No, that just gets rid of my item. Normally she gives like a little spiel like... I can't use this here or whatever, so I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Uh... <sighs> what is the key to do it? I don't remember. Right, Q... These are all the keys I have to find. So it's not E. It's not F, because that brings up my items. I guess I can't use it, which is really weird, because I thought that that was the puzzle. Oh, I can't combine those. Yeah, I remember you can combine things, but... Oh, wait. No. You can't use the syringe to put the smoke into the 
robot or whatever. Uh. Okay, that's not the puzzle then. Anyway, let's go back to the area that I kind of didn't really explore that much. Because I kind of looked at it, but I didn't really go burying up and down that much. So we're going to run back over there. This is really repetitive. Get my cursor off of there. Now I'm remembering, right? But I said it once. How long am I going to spend on this one puzzle because I didn't watch my previous episodes before this one? Gee, I don't know. Are you the same? Yeah, you're the same robot, so I wasn't here before. Oh. I saw that you spoke with the Guardian of the Settlement. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. What? Keep going. Just walk forward, man. <laughs> Do it. Walk forward, okay. This guy is a little bit annoying to follow. He's kind of all over the place. Is he actually walking somewhere, or is he just... Okay, he's this way. This way. This is so awkward. Like, he doesn't just walk ahead. He just kind of goes around me. We're now up. Continuing to walk. This was unexpected. I didn't realize that this was going to happen. Did he... He's not following me into this area? Okay, I wasn't supposed to do that. Oh, there he is. Okay. Right, so it can just resume. Are you gonna... Their pathfinding is a bit odd. There must be a bit of random in there. Are you following me? Like, how am I going to know when he's actually at the destination? Now they're both following me, it looks like. They're going the complete opposite direction of where the other one was leading me, except now they're still following me. Oh, wait, no. Now I'm in this area. That's not where I'm supposed to be. So those guys just follow me around, kind of at random. So you safely reach a building of your destination. Another one of these guys. It's running on this one too. It says guardian of residential area. Looks like they're evacuating the few tamed robots we have here. Makes sense. No point in keeping them in the barrens if all people are already gone. Oh yeah, now I remember. Yeah, I remember what tamed is. Yeah, that was a concept that was brought up before, just refreshing my memory. 
I wonder if the engineer is going to. Apparently, phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. Big ships started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares. I'm not sure what they meant with that. Bummer, it looks like they won't be able to transfer most of these surplus box bots to the city at this rate, and we worked so hard on those. But I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Can't go up there, right? Because it's a ladder. Yeah, you're scared of ladders. Unfortunate that, because it would have made the game easier if you weren't. Have I been up this way? Is that's building number nine, apparently. Okay, this way. We're back here. Okay, I'm just gonna scope this area out again. Look for more notes, maybe. That's the one I already saw. I look like a complete fool right now because I didn't watch the other episode before this. <laughs> That's going to be most of this episode, is me retreading the ground in the one before this. So, let's go. Because I had a goal in mind of what I was supposed to do, and now I forgot. Which sucks. Their factory. A pair of rubber gloves are a bit heavy. seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here is a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Reagents, acidic gas, that's probably the gas that's everywhere, and blue phosphor, rare form. Instructions, in a well-ventilated area, direct the gas of into your container of choice, seal immediately. It's the end of the page. Well, that's not helpful. I already did that step. I already took a, a bottle of the gas, and apparently I need blue phosphor for this experiment, too. Do I have any blue phosphor? I don't think I do, or anything that has anything to do with it. Is that my next goal? Find blue phosphor? And then I can combine the items? You don't have anything useful to say, you're just a robot, right? Welcome to the old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been relocated. Chemical processing plant, okay. You don't have anything to say, it seems like. Hello, person. Robot assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. If you have further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. 